Hey, good morning, everybody. This is Jim from Jim's Holy Sicolius. Uh, hey, we're going to shoot out a quick video on for those of you who want to follow along with me and grow some spectacular coleus. We're gonna we're gonna do really great things this year. Uh, I can't wait uh, for 2020. Um, every year, I learn more and more, and I get more and more excited. And it's uh, it's you guys that really make it exciting because I I have people out there that are following along. And they appreciate what I do, and believe me, uh, it's double back at you because it's you guys that are helping me out. Uh, you motivate me to uh, to do more and more each year. And of course, how can I uh, not be excited about um, the next crop? Because you never know. Each year, there's always something new, and and I always expand uh, the coleus uh, in my collection. So I always get a few coleus that I had in, in the previous year. So it's exciting. And there are hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of coleus. So, uh, but let's get started. Uh, I'm gonna shoot out a real quick video now on, on what I use to uh, sow coleus seeds, what medium I use, uh, whether it's pods or soil, pots, whatever. So, but uh, again, this is a larger scale. I grow six, 700 coleus plants. You can apply this to one coleus. Uh, if you're going to grow a dozen or two dozen, uh, you can apply it to that. So, all right, let's get started. And, and I hope everybody had a great, happy, uh, a great, you know, happy Thanksgiving and uh, or an early Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to everybody. So let's get started and we'll show you what you need to do to grow some spectacular coleus. Okay, it's that time. It's, we're at the starting gate now. Um, Christmas is a couple of weeks off. I mean... Uh, Right around the corner, really. And it's going to be time for Jim's Holiest Sicolius to sow his crop for 2020. Um, this is the, um, the Jiffy Seed Pod set that I recommend people use. Uh, now, again, I grow about 600 plants, so this is a larger scale. Um, if you're an average homeowner and you just want to plant, say, a dozen or two dozen um, coleus seeds... You don't need to buy this big tray. They do sell them in smaller versions, but the most important thing are these pods. And they come with this clear, when you buy it, it'll be just like this. The pods, the cover will be inside and it'll have the label. Don't throw this out. You need this. Cause, because once you sow your seeds, and I'll have a video ready to go in a few, uh, few weeks, this is your dome. Very important to maintain the moisture and uh, the warmth of moisture for when you plant your coleus seeds for uh, germination. Very important to have that dome. So don't throw that away. I save these trays year after year. I rinse them out and save them rather than buy them. And then what I do is I buy bulk these Jiffy Pods. So basically these are compressed peat. And they're excellent. So they're excellent for sowing seeds. And not just coleus. But anything that, that grows with a seed, you can plant with these. And again, I'm going to shoot a video out. I have some on, on my channel. You can go and search for them. But you basically soak them in water. There's the instructions. Very easy. They expand. And then uh, you can plant your seeds. So really at this point now, what I'm doing is pressing them in place. You remember this? The, you can see there's two sides flat and then that round very important to keep that round section up because that's a that's actually a little break in the netting there's some netting here that's holding this all together and it will expand so make sure you keep the circles up and i recommend them now you do you have to use these no i it's just a, it's a medium i like to use coleus will grow in anything I, I joke around that you can you can sow and germinate coleus seeds on moist paper towels if you have to because coleus seeds do not get buried below the surface of the soil. Remember, that's very, very important. Not like traditional seeds. Coleus seeds should, and again, I'm getting ahead of myself, but coleus seeds need light, warmth, and moisture to germinate. 70 to 75 degree term temperatures to germinate. Do not leave them baking in the sun. Uh, but again, I'm getting ahead of myself. So you just gently drop them on the surface. And again, I'll shoot out the video in a couple of weeks. So, um, but you can, um, if you're just a homeowner and you're going to plant yourself a few dozen 
coleus or whatever. You don't need to use these drippy pods. I do suggest you use miracle Grow style um, seed soil. There's seed germinating soil. It's very, very fluffy and light, and it's very easy for the seeds to germinate in. So I suggest that. But if you don't, you can use regular soil. I would really try to stay away from the cheap potting soils from the dollar store because it has a lot of debris in it and so forth, and it, it may be a little difficult. So, um, but you can use pots. If you have little pots and planters that you use that you know you want to grow your coleus in, you can absolutely use that. And again, we'll, uh, we'll get into exactly how to sow the seeds later. So, all right, so um, thanks everybody for following along. Um, get your stuff ready to go. Again, uh, seed pods, you can get these on Amazon or Home Depot, Lowe's, eBay. They, get, they do come in smaller versions. They, I think they come in a 12-pack, in a, a which is perfect. And again, not getting ahead of myself, but when you do sow your seeds on these little pods, no more than four coleus per, seed, per pod. It gets a little tight there. So, and try to spread them out a little bit so they don't... It's easy to um, separate them later on, and we'll do a video with that too. So, Okay, so um, get your stuff ready to go if you're following along, along with Jim here. Jim's Holy of Sicolius, and we're going to get, um, we'll get the season started in a few weeks. Okay, any questions or comments, please feel free to uh, leave them at the, uh, at this, on, uh, on the bottom, and I'll absolutely get back to you. Um, I wish everybody, I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. And um, Christmas, again, right around the corner. So um, thanks for watching. And we'll see you soon. As we uh, fade out here, we'll go through our overwintered plants that are doing great. Look at that. Look at that Saturn coleus just exploding. So. And there's our... Black stockings, that's not doing as well, but it's doing okay. Okay, everybody, so thanks for following along. Get your stuff together, and we'll, uh, we'll see you in a couple of weeks. Take care.